Vortex Light is a high gloss pour on resin that is waterproof and heat and alcohol resistant. Just one coat will give you a beautiful clear glass like finish. Envirotex Light is available in a range of different sizes. The one gallon kit is ideal for coating bars and tabletops, while the half gallon kit is suited to large projects. But for smaller projects such as placemats, photo frames and clocks, a smaller kit will be sufficient. To calculate the amount of resin you need, measure your project dimensions and use ETI's online flood coat calculator. It's always best to mix a little more Envirotex Light than you need. You'll need a painter's drop sheet, gloves, protective eyewear, graduated measuring mixing cups, stir sticks with a flat end, a disposable brush, a handheld barbecue lighter and Envirotex light. For larger projects, you can use a chef's butane torch instead. Make sure you use cups with smooth flat walls and a flat bottom. This will aid with proper mixing. Avoid wax coated cups as the wax can peel away and contaminate the resin. Apply non-absorbent tape or a generous coat of paste wax to the back edges of the project. Once the resin has cured, you can remove the tape along with any drips and it will leave a clean edge behind. Protect your workspace with a drop sheet or several layers of newspaper. Elevate the item approximately 2 inches above the work area, making sure it's level. This will allow the resin to self-level and any excess to flow over the edges of the project. Envirotex Light works best when the room temperature is between 70 and 80 degrees Fahrenheit. If the bottles of resin feel cool to the touch, warm them up in warm tap water for 5 to 10 minutes. If you mix the resin when it's cold, it will result in a cloudy finish filled with microscopic bubbles. Now put on your gloves and protective eyewear and measure out one part of resin and one part of hardener. It's important that you measure each part exactly even if you need the whole kit for your project. Here you can see that there is slightly more resin left than hardener. Mix the resin and hardener together for two full minutes, making sure you scrape down the walls and bottom of the container to free any unmixed resin that's there. Occasionally scrape off the stir stick. Now transfer the resin into the second container and stir for another full minute with a clean stir stick. Pour the resin evenly over your project and carefully work it out to the edges with the long side of a stir stick or a business card. Use a disposable brush to smooth out the drips along the side edges. You'll need to repeat this until the coating is firm enough that it no longer drips. Envirotex Light will self-level provided you have applied enough resin to the surface. Bubbles will rise to the surface of the coating and about 15 minutes after pouring, you can pop these by gently exhaling on them or by passing a flame over the surface. Use a gentle sweeping motion until the bubbles are gone. You can do this again if needed while the resin is still liquid. Allow the resin to cure in a warm dust free place where it won't be disturbed. Here I've elevated a piece of cardboard over the project and then draped it with a drop sheet to keep dust away from the curing resin. It will take 8 hours to reach soft cure and approximately 72 hours to reach hard cure. With just one coat application, Envirotex Light will give you a beautiful glass-like finish.